What we're doing is hiking this slough here, I guess you say, in between these two hills. Just following this creek that feeds the lake, just trying to see where it gets to. Check the other side of your logs. Yep, definitely check the other side of your logs. You never know what's going to be other end, other side of them taking a nap. Also, when you walk around little bodies of water like this, you need to watch where you're stepping too. snakes and so forth it looks like the uh, creek ends right here almost that's what I'm about to find out maybe coming out of the ground right here I mean you can tell where it comes through but let's get down in here in it yeah that's where it comes out of the ground right there Look all in the dust, see this deep on this side here. Look, see where it's under here. Look. Is it down in there? Yes, it's awesome. Look at that. Got this whole ecosystem running under the ground right here. Look, huh? Right there, yep, right through there. So the creek is actually under the ground in this area at the bottom of the hillside. It's crazy. It comes back out on the other side of that, that hill there. I don't think I've ever seen that before. No, you hear about underground rivers all the time, but I mean, this is it on a micro scale. Right. It's awesome. <clears throat> but what that means is somewhere up there, there's a pool. Yeah. A bigger pool. That's feeding this little line. We'll hike up there a little bit just so you can see. Yeah. Try it out. Yeah. So we got hiked about in there 30, 40 feet and we found pretty much where the little creek here goes into the ground. Pretty interesting. Just basically goes underneath the ground there. Under that turkey pond. Under that turkey pond, that big turkey one there. And just about where that tree is leaning over where you start seeing it on the edge of that hill and it comes back out pretty interesting but, i mean you can see that this is the this is the valley here right i don't know yeah we're in like a bowl here almost so all the water pretty much flows off the hills down to here, yeah. Uh -uh. Some coming out of the ground, he's got a little valley up there, but strange. It's just naturally fed. That's the world. So we did a little more hiking following the trail or the stream. Pretty much dried up, but you can see where it has carved its way through this hillside and actually underneath this big, massive turkey pine. Turkey pine. I mean, you how far do you think that? 7,500 foot? At least. The whole root system is undermined. Yeah, the whole root system has been, the dirt and everything's washed away pretty much. First people here got a little irresponsible yeah. campers, but that's an old glass. Yeah, it is. Took that up on the way back. Wow. Yeah. Hike up this hillside and see where this feed goes. And oh, wow.
That's probably six, eight foot of At least washout. Foot deep. You gotta, yeah. You gotta be careful on this edge. Yeah, most definitely be careful on these edges. This is probably undermined here too. Yeah. It was up over the hillside. We're about to find out where it goes to. See what's feeding this. Try to. What you find there, Sean? I got an old green glass bottle. Trying to figure out what it is. Champagne. Champagne. Dom Perignon. Might be. 67 Dom Perignon. Yeah. Try to get it out of here, see what it is. It may not be. There we go. Well, it's cool. Yeah. Moonshine. His hill kind of weird. Get in there with your booger diggers. My booger diggers. Cool. Whatever it is. It's got some letters on it. No deposit. Something. Seven up. I see a seven <laughs> that up. That is right an there. old seven up, that man. That's awesome. That's going back to the house. Dispose of properly. Ha! <laughs> no deposit. They failed on that. Yeah, that's all right. That'll be pretty cool. It's kind of interesting you found out in the woods. Well, all the great stuff's out in the woods. Yeah, we're out here. <laughs> <laughs> All right, man, onward and downward. Yeah, get back to that. Way downward. What do we got now? Come across this weird looking. It's a square bottle almost. It's got a big mouth on it. There's no threads or anything, so it's. Just like your old lady. Right. <laughs> no, it's a medicine bottle. Yeah, I think so. Does it have writing on the bottom? I don't see anything on the bottom or anything. Wait, there's. Nothing I can see. Laudanum. Something. Cool. Definitely cool. Cleaning up the woods. Yep. Thank <laughs> you.